Alright guys, welcome back to American Truck Sim. As always, I'm Sergeant Alpha. And uh, today we're going to do something a little bit different. Uh, we're going to be taking out the Freightliner Sentry. And, uh, you know, I haven't seen these trucks in forever. And I just saw one the other day. Uh, probably about a week or so ago now. And, you know, I just thought it was kind of odd because I've never seen these trucks in uh, uh, a year or two at least, I think. I've always seen the newer Freightliners. And, uh, you know, I figured I'd take out the Freightliner Sentry. It's been a while since I've used it. I don't think I've used it on the channel yet. So I figured I'd do a quick video with it. And, uh, same with the trailer. You know, I never really record with a short trailer, so... I figured we'd go ahead and change it up again and, uh, use a short trailer with the, uh, Freightliner Sentry. We're gonna go ahead and hop in and, uh, take a look at it. Not a bad truck overall. But one thing I don't like is that curtain right there. Because it kind of hinders my view. I have to kind of look, look all the way over like this to uh, see what's over there. But uh, other than that, it's alright. So we're going to uh, go ahead and head out for this delivery. We're going to be heading out to uh, Fresno from Los Angeles. Going to uh, that easily pull out here. Actually, before I do that, I think what we're going to do is we're going to kind of adjust the seat a little bit because it seems like we're sitting. Nope, oh, nope. Oh. Uh, I can't adjust it any higher. It just seems like we're sitting really low for the hood to where I can't really see what the hood's doing. I guess we, since we can't adjust, we're just going to kind of go as is. And uh, hopefully we don't end up hitting anything. Got to uh, have the flashers on. Hope you guys have enjoyed uh, everything that's been going on with the channel. Uh, uh, been pushing out stuff as much as I can. And then... Uh, here recently, I've just had a lot going on, um, personal life-wise, and I ended up actually taking uh, a little bit of time to myself, so I don't really record anything. I think there's one day I, I just kind of took an entire day off, and I uh, forgot to take a nap or something. I ended up sleeping for about 18 hours. <laughs> Uh, a lot longer than I intended, but it was uh, much needed. It's kind of unwind. Uh, I kind of deal with everything that had been going on. So I'll go ahead and uh, continue through the slide here. I guess our lights were all the way on. It just it seemed, the lights seemed kind of dim, but I guess it's just uh, me. Trying to uh, go ahead and try to get up to speed here. The limit is 30. We're running about 30 now. Be uh, taking this right up ahead. Keep right, and then turn right. Turn right. Oh, it's up for that light. There we go. Okay, and uh, get going again. And uh, this is an older mod. It's a, a newer mod. It's one of the term signals and stuff like that. Don't really show up as well. It's not uh, optimized for the newer version, but it does still work. So. Not that unhappy way. It's not something that's going to completely ruin it for me. I know that the uh, turn signal's on and it does work on the outside of the truck. Go ahead and jump out to show you that. Oh, 
Well, like I said, it's not a game breaker for me. Got to uh, try to get back to our. There we go. It's going to uh, continue to cruise along. Uh, I hope you guys have been enjoying the uh, farming sound videos here recently. We gotta change it up from uh, the normal farming sim stuff and kinda have to do it with a little bit of a uh, surprise uh, snowfall. Keep uh, I kinda acknowledge the changing of the seasons. Now that's getting pretty cold for me in North Carolina. Uh, I usually work outside all day. I'm used to 80s and 90s. Like, that thing is a few days we're over 100 and I was out there working in heat and then Suddenly, you know, we're down to 60s and 70s, lows in the 40s, and I'm kind of freezing. Um, so just a little bit uh, of a change for that, so I kind of recognize that. And uh, we'll try to get back into some normal farming sim for too long. Now, I am still uh, planning on trying to get some videos out when I can with uh, United on uh, 5M. Uh, I think I've released, or um, should release pretty soon, a video for Radio Commander. If I haven't, it will come out soon. Uh, if you like the real-time strategy type games, that's uh, pretty much what that is. You're looking at a map and kind of telling people where to go, what to do, stuff like that in Vietnam. And you really can't see what's going on, you're just looking at a map and you're just going off of uh, what they're telling you. Kind of like you really would have if you were uh, kind of directing people at a map and stuff. It's a little bit different, you know, uh, when I reported it, that was the first time I actually loaded up uh, the game. So I was kind of learning as I was going, letting you guys learn with me. Uh, it is kind of fun. I haven't really played too much yet. I've just been busy with everything else and trying to get back into the swing of recording again. Keep left. And I uh, try to get as much as I can knocked out since I am going to uh, be coming into the holiday season at work and uh, with my family and uh, trying to have time to get stuff recorded for you. So just kind of a balancing act there. So we're going to uh, go ahead and hop out again. Let's see if we can get a couple of uh, panoramic shots. There we go. So we're going to go ahead and move on over to the uh, right wing as we come up this grade. Alright, now our uh, flashers on. Not having too much trouble climbing the hill, just want to go ahead and be over here so I'm beating traffic. There's uh, CHP over there on the right. And we're going to uh, start our downhill portion. It's a pretty loud jerkberg. Not expecting it to uh, be that loud. Actually. It's a pretty good break too, it's uh, still on its way down. So we can go ahead and have our flashers off. We're gonna go ahead and merge to the left. So we're not trying to turn. Uh, try to run about 60 through here, Keep so we're not uh, speeding too much. Just 
We're doing about 65. Need to slow down just a little bit. There we go. Set that at 60. And can I continue on our cruise? And, uh, you know, I'm, uh, uh, Red Dead Redemption 2 is coming to the PC before too long. I am going to definitely try to get that for PC and uh, do some episodes with that. And, you know, there's talks of uh, some of my guys doing some multiplayer stuff with it. So, I guess we'll keep an eye out for that and see what happens there. I am looking forward to... Uh, Red Dead Redemption coming out for PC though I've been uh, waiting a long time I was very disappointed when it first came out that it didn't come out for PC because uh, I did like the first uh, Red Dead Redemption and uh, you know, other than uh, a couple of Jeff or uh, Bugs' videos I really didn't look too much into uh, videos for Red Dead Redemption 2, so uh, whenever I do end up playing it and recording it, on. that's going to be uh, uh, first for me, so if you guys haven't seen it, then we'll have a little bit of a shared first time experience going on there. trying to step that wall and just want to pull me over to the other lane. Can't really tell how close I am to this wall. We're going to go ahead and move over there. We don't have anybody in front of us really. Let's go ahead and keep that left lane open in case anybody wants to pass us. Yeah, we've already got to take her right there. Turn to kind of continue moving on down the road. I believe we're going to be exiting soon. Keep right and then exit right. Yep. So we're going to uh, go and have our turn signal on. I'm going to be uh, turning to the left up here. Turn left. Just going to uh, go ahead and hop out here. Let's go see the truck as we make our turn. There we go. That's what I was going for. Continuing on down the road here. Run about 40 speed limit is 55, so we can pick up a little bit of speed. High beams definitely work a lot better than uh, low beams.
just gonna kind of slowly go around this curve. Try to pick up too much speed to where we end up losing it. Get ready to turn right. Alright, so we've got our turn right up here somewhere. Turn right. Oh, right there it is. I'm behind that bush. Somebody left their tractor sitting on the side of the road there. Turn left. Yep, right where this uh, truck turned out from. Yep. He's on down the road here. Get ready to turn left. Yep, we see it right there on the left. Me dropping off at uh, Walmart, looks like. Turn left. So, from uh, Staples to Walmart, that's a little different. It's all over now. Back there in the back for him. There we go. Kind of ease on back. Let's see if we can get a key change thing. Oh, that definitely gonna work. <laughs> I was looking at the uh, building there. Oh, actually, that's a pretty easy spot to uh, back into right there. It's gonna have to uh, straighten it up, but we can pull forward and do that pretty easily. Just wanted to uh, kind of get where I was going first. Are you going to take that, or... No, because it's not facing the... Oh, yep, they are. Alright, so, 
All right, guys, that's going to be about it for this trip. Hope you guys have enjoyed. Oh, there we go. Hope you guys have enjoyed the trip. Uh, like I said, some a little different. Our older truck and a smaller trailer. Now we're going to go ahead and accept the uh, delivery. Yeah, I had to uh, turn off the advanced trailer coupling because of the truck. That's going to be about all I have time for for this episode. If you like what you see, give me a like and subscribe. It'll really help me out. Uh, you can also find me on Switch at Alpha 5 as well as Facebook at Alpha 5 gaming And don't forget to check out the Discord in the description below. If you don't see any screenshots of stuff I do when I'm recording, or maybe I'm going to have some fun for myself. If you guys want to hang out and talk, feel free. If I'm available, I'll definitely hang out and talk to you. If not, I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Alright, until next time. I'll see you guys later.